the 12-gauge shotgun is touted as the ultimate home defender. It's far from a one-trick pony and about as general purpose of a firearm as you can buy. Chances are you've got that one buddy who thinks the AR-15 is the be-all end-all weapon for everything. Then there are the handgun gurus who have spent lifetimes shooting paper and steel but who tend to forget about a little something called terminal ballistics that has everything to do with how something behaves after it has been hit by a bullet. Fact is, most large living creatures don't dramatically fall over dead after they've been hit with a bullet from a 9mm handgun, as they do in the movies. Mind you, I'm not suggesting shotguns aren't overly dramatized in movies too, but there's a reason why shotguns are so feared on the streets, in homes, and on battlefields all over the world. One disclaimer I'd like to make right out of the gate. It has been said and often repeated that the simple sound of racking a shell into the chamber of a shotgun is enough to repel the most determined intruders. This mindset is incredibly naive. When armed and responding to a potential threat, your firearm should be loaded with the safety on and positioned at your choice of ready position. It's a mistake to think racking a shell into the chamber as an act of intimidation will scare an intruder off like you see in Hollywood movies. You have actually just lost the tactical advantage and told a potential adversary that you're armed, what you're armed with, your location, your magazine capacity is limited, and you're untrained. Without further ado, here are my arguments for why a shotgun is the top gun for home defense. Shotguns are powerful. Per trigger pull, the shotgun delivers the most terminally devastating payload possible from a controllable, shoulder-fired firearm. The primary advantage of using a shotgun for self-defense is that it fires multiple projectiles every time you pull the trigger. That's something no other gun can do, at least not effectively. The reason that's an advantage is not because the pellets spread out so that you don't have to aim. At distances inside a home, buckshot is only going to spread a few inches. But because that pattern stays tight, the cumulative effect that cluster of pellets has on the target is devastating. If you take any self-defense training for handguns or carbines, almost across the board, in every class, you'll do drills where you practice shooting a target several times in quick succession. The reason we train this way is because it's not terribly uncommon for a violent attacker to keep doing whatever he wants to do even after he's been shot. So we try to prepare for that worst case scenario and assume that he's going to take two or three or even six shots before he goes down. With a shotgun, we can usually achieve the same results with a single shot. It's very rare for a violent attacker to continue being violent after being hit in the torso with a load of buckshot at close range. So, the shotgun gives us the potential to end a fight a lot quicker than if we use a handgun or a carbine. Because the shotgun is so efficient, I don't think the low ammo capacity is the disadvantage it's often perceived to be, and the heavy recoil is also exaggerated. The real disadvantage of the shotgun is the size. Trying to move around inside a house with a long gun in a way that still allows you to still quickly engage a threat is not easy. You can get an NFA length short barrel, and that might help out a little bit, but it's still a challenge compared to using a handgun. Load versatility. Home defense can mean a lot of different things depending on your geographic location. If you live in a high crime urban area, human intruders may be your primary threat, whereas in more suburban and rural settings, you may find yourself defending pets or livestock from wild predators like coyotes, wolves, and so on. If you only have one gun, load variation is an important consideration, which makes the shotgun an ideal home defense platform. Shotguns can fire an array of standard and non-standard specialty ammunition. Ammo manufacturers offer numerous game-specific loads for practically every animal that walks the planet. Birds, rodents, predators, small game, medium game, large game, dangerous game. They're all covered. Certainly, shotguns can't hold a candle to a rifle in the long-range department. But they can bridge the gap between the close-range effectiveness of a pistol and the long-range effectiveness of a rifle. With Sabbat slugs and a scope, 150-yard accuracy is possible. 
This type of range lends the shotgun on-demand versatility that pistols don't have. The shotgun is far more versatile for home defense than a handgun or rifle. Quite simply, there are far more options available for the 12-gauge shotgun than for any other firearm. Steel shot, varying sizes of buckshot, slugs, less lethal rounds, and other types of projectiles are available. The shotgun can perform the widest variety of tasks one can ask of a firearm by a mile. Certainly, using a shotgun for home defense has its downsides too. Still, if I had to pick one gun for home defense, hunting, survival, and sport, I'm going with a 12-gauge shotgun. And you're unlikely to miss close-range targets. And whatever is hit with it is unlikely to hit back. Black Aces Tactical Pro Bullpup Don't let the rifle guys have all the fun. The Black Aces Pro Bullpup is a unique and compact firearm that offers a modern twist on the traditional shotgun design. One of the standout features of the Bullpup shotgun is its compact size and ease of handling. With an overall length of around 31 inches, the Bullpup shotgun is significantly shorter than traditional shotguns, making it easy to maneuver in tight spaces or confined environments. This can be especially advantageous in home defense scenarios or when navigating through close quarters situations. It's a gas-operated semi-auto with a 3-inch chamber and an 18.5-inch barrel, but the overall length is just under 31 inches. The barrel includes a shroud, which should help dissipate heat near the forehand. The charging handle is amicapable in that it can be swapped to either side. The shell ejection can be as well, and the safety selector and magazine release are also ambidextrous, so it'll keep hot brass from scorching both lefties and righties. The top of the receiver is railed, so you can install the irons or optic of your choice. Rails on both sides and bottom of the forehand allow installation of accessories like a forward grip or light or sling attachments. Like many bullpups, the stock is non-adjustable, so you'll have to learn to work around any fit issues. The Pro Series bullpup takes octal 1919 pattern magazines, which aren't terrifically difficult to source, and there are both standard and drum mags available for those with discretionary income to burn. You also have a dozen finishes to choose from, so make sure you get one that matches the drapes. Benelli M2 The Benelli M2 Tactical is the short-tempered cousin of the M4, and given that the M4 is a certified overall master for multiple fields, the M2 dominates the home defense business. This excellent semi-auto shotgun comes in three stock configurations, pistol grip, standard, and Benelli's fabulous Comfort Tech stock that dramatically reduces felt recoil. For home defense, I recommend you go with the Benelli M2 with a pistol grip if you want better handling. It is also relatively lightweight and comes in a Benelli special wet-dry finish to ensure comfortable, safe handling in all conditions making it ideal for rigorous competition or home defense. The simple design emphasizes speed, smooth and tidy operation, and accounts for increased reliability and easier maintenance. So, it's a perfect budget-friendly option for newbie gun owners who are looking for a fast and efficient home defense shotgun. IWI TS-12 Want something a little out of the box? Then the IWI TS-12 is the gun that certainly fills that niche. A combination of bullpup meets semi-auto shotgun. This semi-auto, gas-powered shotgun kind of looks like it's straight out of a sci-fi flick. It sports an 18.5-inch barrel and uses Beretta Benelli chokes. Plus, it brings plenty of M-lock space to mount accessories. You get 15 shells, 5 in each of the 3 tubes. Rotate the tube, the next shell finds its way into the chamber, and you're ready to go again. With mini shells, which might work, you could have up to 25 rounds on tap. Downside, it doesn't run reliably all the time. We saw failures to eject and failures to load. In short, it's very picky about ammo. That said, it's a really fun gun to run, and if you prefer style over functionality or just want something fun to shoot at the range, the IWI TS-12 fits that bill.